At MSAB, we're always working to improve our software and make every product more user-friendly, intuitive and valuable, and to help save you time. We've recently improved the way that examine displays and counts artifacts. Let's take a look at the new functionality. We've opened this case in examine, and from the start, we can get a lot of information from just looking at the filter pane on the left. The numbers next to each category tell how many artifacts have been extracted for each of them. If we press the arrow to open the messages sub item, we can see more numbers next to each subcategory. Let's see what happens when we add a filter. For example, I'm only interested in artifacts from last week, so I click on last week in the time filter. Notice that the artifact count changes based on the added filter. The new dynamic artifact counting feature lets you see in which categories the artifacts from last week are located. We also see that some categories are greyed out now, which means there are no artifacts in those categories that match the current filter selection. So I don't need to click on them. If I unselect the time filter from last week, then the greyed out categories become available again and the artifact count changes as well. The new dynamic artifact counting feature will help save you time when searching for evidence in examine. And remember that you can always clear all selected filters and start from scratch just by pressing the clear filter selection icon at the top of the filter pane.